What's going on you guys? Today we're learning the song Fool by Cave Town. Real quick before we get into it, I would like to ask that if you find this guitar tutorial helpful, that you please consider subscribing. That would really mean the world to me. Now let's get into it. You are watching. Logan's Lessons. We're gonna have our capo on the sixth fret. This song's actually really easy and it sounds exactly like the recording if you put your capo on the sixth fret. Cause he's playing on a ukulele, so to accommodate that, capo sixth fret, bottom four strings, okay? Just strum the bottom four strings. We do not want the E or the A strings ringing out at any point throughout the song. Okay, so we're gonna start with our third finger on the third fret of the high E string. And we're doing this down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, kind of strumming pattern, that down, up, down, after that first down, continues through. So, after doing twice, so down, down, up, down, down, up, we go to the second fret of the high E. Then you slide it up to the, really, the 11th fret, or the 5th fret from the capo, 11th fret in total. And then slide it up to the 13th fret. So we have this like... Do that with me. Then right here we do basically the same thing, but we gotta keep our first finger on the second fret of the D string the entire time. This is kind of like an E minor shape. Same frets on the high E string, we're just maybe using slightly different fingers. We have our third finger on the third fret of the high E, to our middle finger on the second fret of the high E, pinky on the 11th, and sliding up to the 13th. That might be a little bit of stretch. Then for the third line, we're starting with C major chord shapes. We're gonna put our middle finger on the second fret of the D string, and our first finger on the first fret of the B string. Our pinky finger is gonna take care of that third fret on our high E string, and our third finger on the second fret. Slide that pinky up to the fifth fret. And don't worry, you don't have to go all the way up to the seventh fret from the capo there, that would be painful. We're just going back to the third fret of the high E string. So we have this like, And then for the fourth and final line of this chord progression, so that was the third one, the fourth one, we're starting, we're splitting the measure in half. We're starting on this chord again. And then we go to a D major chord. To play a D major chord, we're going to place our index finger on the second fret of the G string, our third finger on the third fret of the B, and our middle finger on the second fret of the high E. So the entire chord progression will sound like this. Do that with me. That is how you play Fool by Cave Town. If you have a song request, leave it down below. If you wish to be notified of future videos, hit that bell. I sincerely hope that you are well. Please do me a favor and hit that like button blue. I'd really appreciate it if you subscribe too. I hope this video has been a blessing. You've been watching Logan's Lessons.